Alright, this is the final week of Comictober and thank goodness because I've started a new job and this was such a hard thing to do and get everything done. So some things are a little bit sloppy. Yeah, yeah it is. But, you know what? I still got it done and that's an accomplishment and I can be proud of it and I am also so excited that it is over and I don't have to do it again at least for another year if I decide to do it again. That is a big if I decide to do it again. Alright, so day one was the Hulk, which is actually one of my brother's favorite characters. And so, I knew I had to do him justice, even though I'm not a fan of the Hulk. I like Mark Ruffalo, the Hulk, but the character itself has never been one of my favorites. Sorry to any of those of you that um, really like the Hulk. Um, for... The other drawings, it has Kazar, Galactus, and Fury. I did end up drawing a lot of these out of order because I tried to fit more of them onto smaller pieces of paper because I was running out and I did run out at one point and I had to start drawing them in my sketchbook. And then I did get more paper for the last two so thank goodness because my sketchbook is like really thirsty paper so it doesn't really do well with ink and it will ruin your markers. Do not, do not do that. I learned that for next time. Um, I had a lot of fun doing Fury in particular. I really like filling in his coat. I kind of kept him a little bit ragged, a little bit, you know, not completely polished. He just had a nice look to him when it was done and I'm pretty happy with it. It was extremely hard to fit three characters on one small piece of paper when I'm used to drawing large. Alright, next up was Doctor Strange. I really wish I had done better on this, but I just did not have the time. But, you know what, I still went ahead and I got it done, and in the end, it's an alright drawing. I think I could do better, and I really like his character, so obviously you'll see me draw him again, just not for a while. And then the next drawings were of Spider-Gwen and Elektra. Again, I wish I did a little bit better, but I do like the way I drew Spider-Gwen. I just wish I had more paper and more room to draw them on their own thing. But, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Um, Spider-Gwen's a really good character. I love Into the Spider-Verse. The colors and the art style and everything about it is just magnificent. And I admire it so much. And I wish I could have been a part of making it. I won tickets to go see it, actually, because I won a contest on Facebook with Universal and Sony for commenting why and how much I love Spider-Man. And if you don't know, he's my he's my everything. So, yeah, I won tickets. Um, Elektra is really a cool character too. I'm not like the most avid reader in reading things about her, of course, her in Daredevil, you know, and there's the Elektra movie that actually has Jennifer Garner in it, which is an actress I love, but yeah. Next <laughs> was Deadpool. Not one of my favorite characters. I love Ryan Reynolds. He's just a little bit too crude for me when he's not being crude or gross or any of those things. He's really funny. And I love that about him. He can be really good in settings where he's clean enough, you know, to watch. I'm not into, like, gory, crude, rude humor and swears and stuff. But other than that, he can be really funny. And so drawing him, I know, is everyone's favorite. Again, I don't think I quite did him justice, but hey, I'll get better next time, right? And then... The second last day was Captain America. And now I've said this a lot, but he is probably tied for second favorite superhero of mine. I have such a soft spot for him. He's just a good boy. <laughs> He's a very good boy and I love him and his character. I love Chris Evans. And also, fun fact, if you didn't know, Jensen Ackles was also considered for the role and I adore Jensen Ackles because of Supernatural, of course, um, so I would have been happy if he was chosen, but I'm glad it went to Chris Evans. Chris Evans uh, deserved the break and all the fame, and he's such a sweetheart, and he loves Disney, but just 
everything about him. I wanted to make sure I did him justice. <laughs> Captain America justice. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I did decide instead of doing like all the shadows to just fill him in with grayscale and color him flat digitally because it would have been a little bit much just to fill him in with shadows. I think we're taken away from the drawing. And finally, the last day, which is actually meant for Halloween, but I caught up and did the extra few drawings early so you guys could all see this in October, is Venom. Yes, I love Venom. Venom and Carnage are my fave tied. They are dead tied for my favorite supervillains of all time. I love them. I hate, it's funny because I hate parasitical things. They creep me out, but at the same time, that's why I love Venom and Carnage. They have such an insane, creepy, crawly, like, ins oh. something about that. I love it. All right, here are the final drawings. There is Hulk, Kazar, Quantum, you know all that. There's Doctor Strange, Deadpool, Captain America, Venom, I didn't list them all, but hey, I've recorded this a few times and it didn't work. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to watch all the October videos and share them with your friends and let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite. Alright, have a good one.